Today in Minecraft, we grew up as bees. From being born as little baby bees to becoming the bee kings. And if you also want to become the very best, subscribe right now. Sonny, that was a terrible pun. <laughs> Melon, I think we found it. It's the legendary Ender Bees. Yo, the Ender Bees, which contained end honey. We found the corrupted chunk. This is crazy. Be really careful. These bees are known to be aggressive, Melon. Don't touch them. Okay, look, look. This guy's chill, though. He's actually really nice. Don't touch it, Melon. What the heck? Melon, Melon, this isn't good. But Sonny, look, they're peaceful. Look, they're, they're happy with us. Sonny, they're not happy with us. They're not happy. Be with us! Dude, I told you these guys were hostile! Just get the ender honey and get out of here! We gotta go. We gotta go. Ooh, ooh. Give me the ender honey. Give me the ender honey! I got the ender honey. Let's get out of here! Sonny, we gotta go! We gotta go! Half a heart! Half a heart! Run! Melon, Melon, did you get out of there with your ender honey? Yeah, bro. I got three ender honey bottles. Same here. Wait, Melon, the bees, they're still chasing us. We gotta go. We gotta go. Don't stop until we get home. Home, sweet home, Sonny. We actually made it. I can't believe we looted the ender bees. That is so cool. And now we take our prize, Sonny. Cheers, drink up. Oh, this is gonna be tasty. Whoa. I didn't drink mine. I was way too scared. I want to see what happens to Sunny first. Yo, Melon. Everything is getting slower. The world's looking like honey. It's all dripping and blending. I don't feel so good. Maybe I should drink another one. Sunny, what are you doing? Relax. Oh, the whole world is yellow. It kind of looks delicious like honey. Yo, where am I? What is this place? I'm stuck in a beehive. Wait a second. I'm a baby bee. Yo, this is incredible. But also really, really really weird. How the heck did this happen? The last thing I remember is I drank the ender honey. And now I'm a bee. This is the best day ever. But how do I get out of here? I want to spread my wings and fly. I want to go pollinate flowers and I want to meet the queen. I bet she's beautiful. Uh, hello? Is anybody else here? How do I get out of this place? Sunny. Sunny. Wait a second. Is that melon? Where are you? Sunny. I'm up here, bro. Up, look up. Whoa, I see you. You're a red bee. You look so cool. Thank you, dude. Here, take some food, Sonny. You must be starving. Actually, I'm okay right now. Oh, well, keep that for the future. If you want to be a functioning member of this hive, Sonny, I'm going to need you to fly up here right now. Okay, I can do this. And fly! I mean, my wings are flapping, but I'm not really going anywhere. Sonny, think about it like riding a bicycle. Just let the instincts take over. Yeah, but I've never mm -hmm. flown in my entire life. Riding a bike, I started with training wheels, and then I worked my way up. Okay, okay, think about it as walking, Sonny. You never walked in your whole life until you walked. You know what I mean? Ah, that makes a lot of sense. It's time for me to fly. Yo, you did it, Sonny. You did it, you little baby bee. That was so cool. I could spread my wings and fly. Bro, <laughs> I don't have great control over it, but that was epic. Now, Sonny, that you're a master of flying, follow me. I wouldn't call myself an expert at this. I've only flown twice in my whole life, Melon. I'm kind of scared. I don't want to jump down that hole. What if I get hurt? You won't, Sonny. You've got to believe in yourself. Hey, if you're going to make awesome jokes like that, then I could do it. Ah! Oh, you're right. There you go. I didn't take any damage. Follow me. I'm right behind you. <laughs> Sonny, we've left the high. Fly. Fly like a bird. No, fly like a bee. Wait, Melon, I'm dropping. Oh, I'm flying. Isn't this awesome, Sonny? Now, I got to take you into the next hive. Oh, this is incredible. Look at how many hives we have out here. It's so beautiful. Now follow me, Sonny. We're going in. I'm right behind you. Whoa, Melon Bee. This is awesome. No way. I grew up a little bit. I'm no longer a little baby bee. I'm a kid. That's what happens when you learn how to fly. You've enjoyed the joys of being a bee. Now now, Sonny, it's time 
to face the hardships. You will become a powerful warrior, B, and serve the hive. Wait, Melon, I don't like this very much. This is a sword, bro, and it's called a stinger. I don't want to fight you. You must learn how to wield your stinger. Defeat me, and you may grow up be the bee you were always meant to be. Okay. I'm out of here. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. I'll kill you. Die. 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 Eh, you can't get me. I'm too slick. Uh, get over here, you small boy. Phoning in. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, phoning into top B. Yep. I want to disable flight in chamber A7. Yep. Over. Yep. Wait, I can't fly. Now we face off, Sonny. Die. I don't want to fight. I didn't want to fight you. Ow. It's okay, Sonny. All bees are reborn in the hive. As long as the queen is here, we're all okay. I've been reborn in the hive. <laughs> Melon, if you really want to have a battle of stingers, I will destroy you. All right, well, I'm going to just kill you real quick. Oh, oh it's even so far. hi -ya! No, no. hi -ya! Oh, it's close. It's close. It's close. Yeah. You grow stronger, Mr. Sunny. With each rebirth, I grow more powerful. Melon, I no longer fear you. You might be my teacher, but I will become the real master. You're not yet ready. I shall show you! Time for me to show you the business. Oh, no! Merge from the honey. Congratulations, Sonny. You've became a warrior. Thank you, Senpai Melon. I do the best I can to prove my worth to the hive. One day, I will be the queen's best warrior. Do not use B and Queen in the same sentence. That is just flagrant disrespect. Hey, I'm sorry. I just thought she was beautiful. Don't say that! No, please, please, Melon. I have half a heart. I'll let it slide just this once, Sonny. But there are no B puns to be used in the Queen's name. I concur. Anyways, Sonny, you're ready for the outside world. Do you want to see the flowers? Yeah, let's go pollinate some flowers. Follow. Follow me! Let's go! Whoa, Melon Bee! This is so incredible! Look at all the beautiful flowers! Oh, I just want to pollinate all of them. Sonny, there's so many flowers, but you can only pick one! So choose wisely. Oh, the yellow one's calling for me. It looks so awesome. Is that really what you want to be, Sonny, for the rest of your life? Wait, you didn't say I was going to become something from this. I, I thought I was just picking my favorite color. I didn't say anything. I didn't say anything. Forget I said anything. Just pick the flower flower which calls to you. Well, in that case, the red one's calling for me because you picked the red one, I'm sure of it, and you turned out to be an epic warrior bee. Uh, no comment? No comment? Yeah, I'm choosing red. Let's go! Sonny, you have chosen the flower color red. It means you're destined to be a warrior like the great melon. Oh, ow, chill! Bro, what does the yellow one do? You would have been responsible for cleaning the queen's poop. Yo, that's disgusting. I'm so glad I didn't do that. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Now, Sonny, begin pollination. Yes, Master Melon. I have acquired the pollen. We must return it to the nest in order to create some delicious honey. Follow me. Sonny, we've arrived. Today, you will meet the queen. No way. I've been dreaming of this moment. Hello, queen's guards. Yes, I'm just bringing Sonny in for his first time pollination. He's gonna meet the queen. It's gonna be great. Chip, chip, cheerio. Melon, do you remember the code? Of course I remember remember the code. Hey guys, yeah, first day on the job. I know, I'm gonna be a legend of this hive in no time. So remember the name, Sonny Beesington, because that's, that's my name. I think the code is this. Beautiful! Sonny, you may now enter. That was awesome, bro. Now I'm right behind you. I'm gonna stay close to you because I've never been here before. I don't want to get lost. There's a lot of crazy bees in here. Look at them! Sonny, if you chose the yellow flower, you'd have been just like them. The worker bees. They clean up the queen's poop. Yeah, yeah, but they do look pretty cool still. Now, Sonny, deliver your pollen to the worker bees. And then they're gonna process this, turn it into honey, and tell the queen that I did this because I'm the best bee ever? Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, sure. Uh, just give him the pollen now, please, Sonny. Huh! Now follow me. You will be inaugurated by the queen. Oh, perfect. And she's going to tell you to start to mind your own business because I'm going to be the new top warrior. Sonny, I'm warning you. No bee puns in front of the queen. She does not like bee puns. Uh, Melon, I feel a little strange right now, though. Oh, whoa. Yo, I grew up again. Yep, pollination makes you a man here in the hive. And now you're all grown up so you can meet the queen. Oh, it feels so good to be all grown up now. Melon, wouldn't you call me beautiful? No. But beauty lies in the eye of the beholder. <laughs> Sonny, enough puns! Enough puns! Fine, fine, fine. Let's go see the queen. I've got a question to ask her. All right. Yep, I'm here to take this first-time pollinator to the queen. Actually, we're under attack. Our systems detected that an incoming wasp army is preparing to land any second now. Wait, what? We're under attack! Sonny, as a warrior bee, it's our duty to defend the hive. Follow me! Already? My first mission? This is awesome! Yes, I believe in you. It's okay. We can make puns now. We're out of the nest. In that case, Melon, what type of of gum do bees chew? I don't know. Bumble gum. <laughs> uh... Melon, I located the enemies. There's wasps over here. You're not gonna hurt our queen. Take them out. Take them out. <laughs> it looks like they forgot how to fly. <laughs> Get wrecked. Melon, there's one left behind. It's time for us to question him. Hello, Mr. Wasp. What's your plan? Why would you try and attack our hive? <laughs> you fools. You don't get it, do you? This was all just a diversion tactic. You might have gotten rid of us, but the others have already made it to the hive. What do you mean this was just a diversion? <gasps> Sonny, we gotta get back to the hive now. There's no time for him. Follow me. Protect the queen. I'm coming, queen. Wait, what's that? What just happened? What just happened? Save the queen. Save the queen. What is this? Wasp invasion. Sonny, I need help. I'm here. I'm here. Yo, we gotta drive by. We gotta use our power of flight against the wasps. Hey ya, hey ya. Ow. Melon, keep them distracted. I'll smack him from behind. Die, wasps. Smack him from behind. I need your help. Ooh, what down? I need to eat my honey bread. My honey bread. Our honey will never be yours. Die. Two down. They're so evil. Okay, one last one left, Sonny. I'm low. I'm low. Die! Hit him! Yeah, Wombo Combo! That was awesome! We defeated the wasps! Sonny, it's not over yet. Not until we make sure the queen is safe. Sir, the factory is in danger from the deadly wasps. You need to go and stop them, please. The whole of Bee Kind depends on you, Sonny and Melon. What do you mean the factory's in danger? Melon, we gotta save the hive! We gotta go! Worker bees, where's the threat? There's only one wasp! Let's take him out, Sonny. Let's take him out. What are you doing here? You're too late. For this was just another distraction. Go and check on your precious queen. No way. He's another distraction? Sonny, no time for this guy. We gotta move. The queen's safety is all that matters. The queen? The queen! Wait, the guards? The guards have been killed! Minecraft, save the queen, please. What is- Why, why are they crawling? What's- Yo! Wasps! Sonny, we gotta take him out! Not good! They killed another queen's guard! No way. The queen's security detail. They're all dying! Melon, the queen! She's missing! Sonny. What are we gonna do? Where did they go? Why? Bro, it looks like the wasps broke out through here and kidnapped our queen. They left a book behind. What does it say? Bzzz, 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 Wait, that says the queen is being held hostage in a cage and the coordinates for the meat point are right there. This isn't good, Melon. It also said they're trying to sell her to humans. No, we gotta go now. Anything but humans. We can't. Can't let our queen be a part of a human bee farm. Mella, we've been flying for a long time, which means I've cooked up some great puns. What's a bee's favorite sport? Uh, I don't know. Rugby. <sighs> Sonny, that was terrible. But what's not terrible is the fact that we have reinforcements, Sonny. The word must have spread to neighboring beehives and backups arrived to help us. Time to take out those pesky wasps. Hey, but first, Melon, I got a question for you. What do bees like with their sushi? What do they like, Sonny? Wasabi. Oh, good one, good one. All right, no puns in front of the queen. I swear by the queen's name, I will slay you. Deal. Okay, let's 
Let's fight these wasps. Melon, there's only one way to make this battle work in our favor. What's that? TNT. A surprise attack. Oh, they'll never see it coming. You better believe it. <laughs> Back up. Let it explode. Go, go, go. Help the guardian. Kill the wasp. Go. Go. We can take them out. We can take them out. We've got this. We've got this. Ow, ow, ow. Guards, guards. One last wasp. Yes. We did it, Melon. We defeated all the evil wasps. Now it's time to set the queen free. The honor is all yours, General Sonny. Thank you, Master Melon. We've protected our queen from the evil human beekeepers. And now I release her. Sonny, Sonny. Sunny, 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 my queen, you're free. I just got one question for you. What do you call a wasp? A wannabe. What? You didn't like my joke. Chill, queen. Ow, ow, the queen's attacking. Sunny, 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 sunny. Sunny, 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 sunny. Sonny! Sonny! Are you coming too? I can finally hear you! Melon! Melon! What happened? Is the queen okay? How's the queen? Sonny, what are you talking about? What queen? You've been asleep for the past seven days! Wait, what do you mean? Our queen, bro! She's got the big wings, she's got the best honey in town, the queen bee! Ever since you drank the potion, you've been passed out, it's been a whole week, man. There's no way, bro! This can't be true! What about my wings? Check this out! I can fly! Sonny, you don't have wings, you don't have- Ow. Sonny, go back inside. You're clearly not mentally prepared for the world right now. No, I'm gonna go check out the beehive. I can still save my queen. There's no beehive. There's no beehive. What are you talking about? Yes, I see the hives. My queen. Sonny, stop. It's dangerous. These bees are hostile. I don't know. They seem pretty friendly. Sonny, they're not happy with you. Get away from the beehive. No, no. My queen. My queen. Please. Please. Guys, I tried to warn him. And that's why you never take honey from a beehive. But you guys should press that like and subscribe button. This is my Minecraft journey from the moment I was born until the day I became an old man. <laughs> Sonny, you look so dumb with that giant grandpa beard. Oh, like the video right now to turn Melon into an old man too. Press it quick. Oh, my back. No! Melon! I feel so tiny! Dude, look at you! You're a baby! Why am I a baby? Actually, this feels pretty right and comfortable. I think I'm just gonna cuddle up and relax and live life. Dude, I suddenly have a craving for warm milk. I need milk, Melon! Get me out of this baby gate! Here, let me help you. Let me help you, Sonny! Boost me! Boost me! Yes! Let me out! Oh, wait. We could've just broke it. It's pretty easy to break. How are you the world's strongest baby? That's crazy. Here, let me just let me just put that back. Yeah, we don't want our babysitter to know we busted out like that. Be careful. We gotta escape. Wait, I can't hit these walls for some reason. Dang it, bro. We can't bust out of here. It's not as easy. Wait a second. Our babysitter's not home. We don't have to worry. We can find another way out, Melon. Wait, do you hear that? Oh, she's here. She's just taking a big old poop. Yo, she's stanking up the bathroom. That's nasty. Yeah, she's pooping and farting. Wait, Sonny, do you see that right there? Yo, the window, it's open. Whoa, I escaped, Sonny. I see daylight. And, oh, there's a cool park right here. Let's check this out. Yeah, I'm with you, Melon. I'm gonna hop on the carousel. Start it up. Yeah. Yo. Ow, ow, it's a carousel of death. Ow, Melon, get in here quick or stop it, please. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy this slide instead. Hang you, Melon. Give me this in time to go on the ride of my life. Yo, that looks awesome. Yo, that was actually so epic. Here, my turn, my turn. Oh, Melon. My turn, I want to go on it again. You know what, you have fun with that, bro. I'm taking my tricycle and I'm leaving <laughs> you behind. Melon, I don't think this is a good way to ride a tricycle i'm scratching my butt does is your butt okay <laughs> it looks like it's hurting ow 
Ow! I'm getting a major case of bottom rug burn. Ow! Oh, this is very painful. It does not feel good on the cement. It doesn't, but at least we're breaking out of daycare. Let's go, bro. Go, dude. Ultimate freedom. These babies can't be held down. These babies are going to go to the most epic playground. Melon, look at this place. It's so beautiful. Look at the monkey bars in the swing set, bro. We busted out to get on the cool place. Let's go. This is where the big kids hang out, bro. Are you kidding me? Trampoline. Wait, Melon, I want to get on the trampoline. Wait for me. No, this is my trampoline. Nope, it's mine too. Boing. There's only room for one. Boing. Boing. Yo, how come you're going higher than me? Get out of here. You know what? Now you made it bad. Ow. Wait, what's down here? Something's calling me down this path. This is so weird. What is it, Melon? What are you being drawn to? I don't know. I want to go to this school for some reason. It's like something, some part of me is drawn to it. You need the knowledge, bro. You're trying to get your fourth melon seed. Melon, we grew up a little bit. We're taller. Yo, you're right, bro. Something about this school made us age. That is so bizarre. Melon, did you hear that? Wait, Sonny, we gotta get to class. Oh, 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 crap. The bell rang. Follow me. I'm with you, bro. I forgot my agenda. Do you know which classroom we're supposed to be in? No, but... <laughs> I can smell it. I can smell the class. Follow me. That's a little sus, Melon. I don't know how you could smell a classroom from this far. You don't smell that knowledge? <laughs> Bro. Oh, there's so much education. I can feel it. Room 305. It's in here. I'm sorry we're late, Miss Dingleberry. It won't happen again, all right? I don't know if you were smelling knowledge or Miss Dingleberry. She is dead. Thank you, bro. Oh, she's got a few dingleberries, if you know what I mean. Gross, dude. No, what? We, don't, we didn't say anything. Nothing at all, right, Sonny? Uh, she doesn't smell that bad, Melon. She's kind of okay, our teacher. Yeah. Wait, no, no, no. I don't want detention. I don't want detention. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Thank you so much, Miss Dingleberry. It won't happen again. Sonny, do you hear that? It's the bell. It's time for our next class. Let's go. Melon, I'm stuck under my desk. Melon, please help me. Let me help you. Hey, thanks. Dude, we got gym next. Uh, follow me. I know my way around this place. Dude, you've absorbed so much knowledge so quickly. I feel like I've lived here forever. Yo, Jim, let's go. Yo, Sonny, tag, 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 you're it. You're it. <laughs> you're it. You're it. Got him. No tag backs. No tag backs. No tag backs. Bro, you what? How, who am I going to tag? There's no one else in this class. Uh, Miss Dingleberry's upstairs. Uh, I'll be right back. And while Mel is doing that, let me see if I can find the weights. I'm trying to lift heavy weights and become the strongest eight year old ever. I'm going to squat sets of 420 pounds. I just got to find where they rack these weights up. Um. This doesn't look like the weight training room. What is this, Sonny? Don't know. I'm scared. Why don't you explore it first? You know what, Sonny? You're right. I'm the brave and courageous one. And the dumb one. What the heck? Oh, uh, Sonny, there's so many zombies. Help me. Okay, I won't leave my bro alone. I'm right here. I'm right here. Sonny, there's an escape route. We can go through the sewers. Are you serious? You expect me to jump into these nasty, stanky sewers? You know how much dingleberry poops in here? This is the only way out. Oh, these zombies are scary, man. Ugh, gross. Disgusting. I know you're used to this stank with all your fertilizer and stuff, but this is gross. Sonny, that is so not cool. Hurry up! Uh, the zombies are only after you. I'm safe. Yo, I just zoomed right past them. Let's go goat mode. Wait, there's a barrel over here, Sonny. Uh, you want to check it out since I was so brave before? Yeah, there's also a dead skeleton skull. Are you sure this is safe? <laughs> Yo! Emeralds! We're rich! Three stacks. Let's go! We're rich and... Ah! Ah! Sonny, I gotta move. I gotta keep moving. Sonny, follow me. We gotta get out of here. There's some weird pipes over here. Maybe there's an exit. Ow! Ow! Watch out for the zombie! Run! Dude, we gotta get out of the sewer system quickly! Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, I found an escape! 
Yes! Uh. Uh. Melon? Sonny? Sir Quandale, Miss Dingleberry, and Mr. Berry are all here. <laughs> what? Detention for the next five years? Are you kidding me? What? This is not cool. Melon, I can't believe we're stuck in detention for five years. But at least they didn't confiscate my emeralds. Yeah, at least we'll have something on the other side. This is so annoying though, Sonny. Five years, feel like I'm gonna go crazy. I know, and Miss Diggleberry still smells so bad. She needs deodorant. And what subject are we even learning? I think painting, bro. Just painting. What are we gonna do? Everyone knows an art degree is useless. This is what I think of your painting. And hi -yah! Uh, what did I just find? Melon, this could be our way out. I need you to distract Miss Dingleberry. You can give her an emerald or something, okay? Okay, okay. Hello, Miss Dingleberry. Uh, don't you like what I have? Yes, look at the greenness. Sonny, you'll have to go on without me. There's no way I can escape. I'm going. Yeah, I'm sorry. I know I didn't leave you any more distractions. It's up to me. I'll get out of here. All right. Make us proud, Sonny. Make us proud. I'm breaking out of school, guys. I'm such a rebel. But how am I going to get off of this rooftop? <gasps> Oh, this is scary. There's got to be a way down somewhere. Please find it. Yo, if I can land in this water. Just got to clutch up. Yes, I'm alive. And I've escaped school. Melon, I'll come back for you. With all these emeralds, I'll be able to buy us a getaway mobile. Please, Sonny. Please. I think there's a motorcycle shop just around here. And I hear they'll sell bikes to anyone these days. Even kids. Let's see. Where's the vendor? Oh, here he is. Wait, how many emeralds for that bike? Dude, I can't afford that. 500 emeralds, that's a ripoff. Yo, how about this piece of trash red one outside? It looks a bit rusty and old. Yeah, one stack. You have a deal. One stack of emeralds. And now I can take this bike. Let's go. Melon, I'll be there soon. I just got to investigate our escape plan. Let's see what's at the end of this road. There's got to be something cool. Yo, the forest. This could be it. We can live off the fat of the land. I'm actually quite enjoying detention. I'm learning a lot. Look at this book, World Knowledge. I've learned so many things here. Hmm, this place isn't actually too bad. Yes, we could live here forever. Wait a second. There's something not quite right about this place. Why is the world border cutting it off? No, you gotta be kidding me. We can't be stuck in this city forever. Something's not right. Right. I gotta go get Melon. He's been in detention for years. Melon, Melon, are you still in detention? Hey, Sonny, what's up? I'm coming to break you out of there. There's two seats on this bike. I don't know, Sonny. You're just a dropout, and I'm learning so many things here. As Aphrodite once said, knowledge is power, and power is wisdom. Melon, the school is corrupting you. You need to live free, fast, and die young. Uh, I'm good, Sonny. I don't want to join you in your dropout ways. I'm just gonna stay here and learn. Goodbye. I don't know what happened to Melon. He's changed. The books, they've corrupted him. He's no longer living a reckless lifestyle, free of the corporate world of the establishment. <sighs> I guess I still have to get a job if I'm gonna pay my bills. Dang it. The only thing I'm good at is driving. I hope this taxi company will hire me. Guys, after five years of detention, I'm finally free. Let's go. Just gotta head to my classroom and grab a few things. Wait, what's in here? Whoa, job offer for Melon? Yo, wait, I'm all grown up. I'm normal again. And now it's time to work a job. This is gonna be awesome. I've been working this job for two years, guys. You can see I grew up. I'm a full Sunny again. This is my cab and I'm going off to work today. I have an important new client. Just gotta go pick him up. And according to my GPS, I'm almost at my new client's house. Gotta pick him up and bring him to work. This is it here. Wow, that's a nice place. Look at this dude's pool. Excuse me, sir. You ordered a taxi. This is Sonny's Taxis Incorporated. Wait, Sonny? Is that you? Yeah, I'm a free agent working at the Taxi Corp, Cray Inc. I have my own little subsidiary, Sonny's. This is your house? Yeah, dude, this is my house. It's so awesome to see you, Sonny. 
been such a long time. Is everything okay? Yeah, I'm good, dude. I'm good. Uh, I just got a long day at work, so can you just drive me there? Sure thing, Melon. You're the boss today. I'll take you straight to your office. Thank you so much, Sonny. Feel free to adjust the radio, bro. I got all kinds of tunes on this. I just live free on the road every day. Oh, that's okay. I don't like listening to music. Like, you see this red light? Blowing it! That's really dangerous, Sonny. You shouldn't be doing that. It's okay. I run these streets. Everyone out here knows me. Uh, by the way, where's your office? Uh, I just thought I'd take you on a tour of the old school. Sonny, I need you to take me to the office. It's on 2nd and 3rd Street. Okay. You sound quite down. Are you catching a cold or something? No. It's just like a lot of work, man. It's my life now. Just busy? Just real busy? Real busy. Well, here we are. This is the office, right? Yeah. You want to see a tour of it? That would be great. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I'll show you around. I'm actually the manager of this establishment. Oh, that's great to hear. It sounds like you've been really climbing the corporate ladder, huh? Yeah, I really have. Quadel, shut up! This is the place. It's pretty cool. And yeah. Guys, I do not want to get on Melon's bad side. Poor Quandale. So, Melon, everything's good with you then, right? I can just pick you up after work? Yeah, that would be great. Have a nice day, Sonny. Hey, same to you, bro. Have a good one. See ya. Get back to work! Hey, guys, I really do not feel good about that experience. Melon seems really bummed out from work. I feel like the corporate structure's just not meant for him. He's supposed to be out living free in the farm patches, but now Melon is grinding away, wasting his entire life. His melon top was even turning gray. Did you see that? It's not the life for him. I gotta find a way to get him out of this rut. Let's see, I've got an idea. I'm gonna put an emerald in the passenger seat here and then tell Melon that he left it in the car. Uh, excuse me, can you get- Melon, your employees are very rude. What did they say, Sonny? I will discipline them. Um, you don't need to discipline them. And actually, they said nothing. That was really the problem. I was trying to get them to get you for me, but at least now I got your attention. So, Melon, I, I just needed to check in with you. It's company policy. Uh, you left something in the vehicle. I'm gonna need you to come and make sure that it's yours or I have to bring it to lost and found. Okay, I will go check it out. Yeah, it's just uh yeah, just out here in in my nice yellow taxi. Okay, where is this item? I don't see it. Other side, is that your emerald? Uh, you could very well be. I have so many emeralds. Is that your emerald as well? Yeah, I see some more emeralds in here. They could be mine. Sonny, what are you doing? I locked the doors! You're not getting out of this vehicle, Melon! You're coming with me! I have a lot of work to do right now. Melon, you're coming with me, bro! I'm bringing you back to where we were first babies together. Do you remember this place, huh? Do you remember this playground? You used to have so much more energy, so much more life. I did. I do remember that a little bit. Times were simpler. Oh, could you spin me around, Sonny? Sure thing, Melon. Anything to get you out of your rut. Are you having fun? <laughs> Yo! This is awesome! Wait, that's the old Melon I know. He's back, guys. You're back to normal. Let's go. Yo, I can't wait to ride this cart all the way down. That's the wrong way. I'll boost you. Don't worry. Stay in the cart. I got you, brother. Go. Have the time of your life. Marilyn, one question for you. What's up? You remember in school when we got detention? Back when we were younger and happier? Mm-hmm. There was a place down there that we never fully explored. But today, we're gonna find out what lurks below the sewers. Yo, a good old mystery, I love this. Just follow me. I don't need my windows anymore. Not where we're going. Melon, I've stored some supplies in here for decades. Whoa, what are we using that TNT for? You'll know when you see it. Why do we need netherite armor? Just in case, we don't know what lurks beneath the sewers. And here, I'll give you a crossbow and a bunch of arrows. Oh, this is crazy, Sonny. And I'll give you half of our original loot. I've been saving these emeralds ever since we were babies. Hey, don't point that at me. That's dangerous. Hey, you forgot your booties. Oh, no, I, I got my boots on. Those are your boots. No, nope, no, nope, those, I got my boots on, dude. Those are your boots. Oh my gosh, my boots were glitching. Give me my boots back. What, are we in a simulation or something? Yeah, that would be freaking weird. That'd be freaky. Okay, now Melon, follow me. Oh, we can't fit out of this window anymore. Turns out we're not that small. Uh, we can use the front door. Oh! 
Oh, true. Yeah, let's get rid of this baby gate. And let's roll. Melon, get in, get in. I'm in. Oh, sorry about that. I still never really got me driver's license. Oh, that is extremely dangerous, and I am entirely scared right now. You know me. I like to live recklessly, bruh. I convinced the taxi corporation to let me drive because I gave them extra emeralds. Melon, do you remember where the school is? Uh, yeah, you went past it. Okay, I'm gonna make a left turn here. Okay, yeah, that works. This works. It's all right. I'm taking the long way, the scenic route. Might want to take another left. Yep, and then from here, you're gonna want to take a right. Please don't go to your old offices. Ignore that. You saw nothing. Uh... Uh, what did I talk about? No, you saw nothing, Melon. Your old offices. <laughs> I'm messing with you, Sonny. Oh, dude, I thought you turned into a corporate zombie again. Yo. Where's the sewer place? Where are you going? There it is, Sonny. Take a left. No, left. A left? Yes. Yes, a little bit more of a left. There you go. Oh, there's the sewers. Thanks, Melon. Where would I be without you? Run him over! This is for five years of detention. Wait, Melon, I have a better way to solve this. Hold on, let me handle it. Oh, yep, that works out perfectly. That's why I brought the TNT. They still survived. And not for long, Sir Quandale and Miss Dingleberry are no more. We're free. <laughs> now, let's see what's down in these sewers. Bro, there was a lot of zombies down here. I don't think anybody even knew about this. We might have been the first people to explore the sewers ever since they were constructed in the year 100. This is so weird. Big jump, big jump. Make the jump, Melon, Melon, Melon. It's fine, you have netherite. You're fine, you have netherite. You're fine. What is this? The legendary hand crank. Everyone knows this is the most mysterious item in Minecraft. I'm gonna put it right here and hopefully nothing bad happens. I will crank it. Whoa! What did we just discover? Crank it. Crank it again. I'm cranking that soldier. Keep cranking. Crank that soldier. Ow. Ow. Sonny, do you have a pickaxe? Uh, no, but I do have TNT. Here, we'll break it by hand. Yeah, that's probably the better idea. Now that we're adults, we're so much stronger. It's easy. Wait, what are these sounds? Yo, pillagers! What the heck? What did we find? I knew this place was cursed. Take them out. Sonny. Fire back. Eliminate them. Show them who Who's the more powerful range weapon at point blank? Yes. Uh, what the heck are they up to? Let's find out. Yo, key card? And there's a button. Whoa! That's epic, Melon! Sonny, what did you just press? Uh, I don't know. I think we're fine. There's lava directly above us, but I think we're okay. Yo, city project outbreak. What the heck? They have so many zombies. Dude, there's villagers. Yo, what? Yo! Yo, the zombies got out. Sonny, what do we do? We gotta defend ourselves. Kill them. Oh, wait, there's too many. There's too many. Just run. Just run. You have the key card. Melon, there's a key card thing right behind you. Put it in the security. Yo, we gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Sonny, come. Melon, please. Melon, please. Come, Sonny. I'm trying. Open the door. Thank you. Yo, kill this one. He got out. He got out. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yo, we're safe. We're safe. In case of facility breach, immediately evacuate. Yeah, this is not good. We gotta get the heck out of here. What? the heck are these plans, Sonny? What is going on? What have we uncovered? Melon, this place is so sus. Let's explore and see if we can learn more about it, though. Melon? What'd you find? What'd you find? Come in this room. There's two chairs with a gold block and a melon block. What does that mean, bro? What happens if I flick this leather? Don't flick it. Just come and sit down. Melon, just sit down, bro. I want to swap brains with you. <laughs> Eh, just a prank, bro. Just a prank. Oh, wait, no. I'm stuck in my chair. Melon, please. No, please help. There you go. There you go. Just, just walk forward. Why do I always get stuck on chairs? Okay, I'm good. On a real, though, what is that? That is really weird. I don't know, Sonny. I'm just as confused as you. Wait, this is a map of the village. Birth, school, job, death. Wait, death? Sonny, simulation 143. Same subject, Sonny and Melon. Dude, don't tell me this isn't real. Sonny, come to think of it, it was weird, bro. We aged so rapidly in school, from birth to school, and then when we got our job, we aged at an insane rate. I didn't even think about it. Dude, that's true. Right after detention, you became an office zombie. Sonny, I don't want to die. I'm too young to die. Sonny! Melon! Melon! They're here for us! They're here! I'm destroying this simulation, Melon! Get to the evacuation portal! Blow it up! Go! 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 In the portal! Melon! We made it! 
We're back in normal Minecraft. It's so beautiful, sheep. And I can even go and punch a tree. Oh, yes. Normal world. Getting wood. The first achievement in Minecraft. Melon, you're so talented. I know. And if you guys want to be as talented as me, which is almost impossible, make sure you like and subscribe. Today in Minecraft, Melon went from being a nerd to super popular in school. I used to be bullied for being a dorky nerd, but after we saved the school from the evil Dr. Longbottoms, we became so popular. And if you subscribe to our channel right now, you'll be cool too. Okay, guys, it's my first day at school and I'm kind of nervous, bro. I hope I fit in. Hey, guys, look at this nerd coming to school. What's his name? Melon? Stop right there! Yo, what the heck, bro? What's wrong with you? You're not going anywhere, nerd. Watch this. <laughs> Why? Why would you do that? Because there was nothing you could do to stop me. When you're the coolest, strongest, most popular kid in school, you can do anything you want. Yo, chill. I don't want to hold my dead kind. Bro, what if I murdered the sun? How would you feel? You can't, so I don't have to think about it. <laughs> I gotta get to class, bro. I'm gonna be late. No, no, you're gonna be late. Ow! That's absolutely right. You will be. I'm not done picking on you, nerd. Boom! Ow! Bang! Ow! Ow! Actually, uh, you probably should head to class before I get in too much trouble with the school's staff office. <laughs> Am I right, guys? Yeah, I know. I'm pretty cool. Oh, I gotta get out of here. Oh, that guy is so mean. Okay, I just gotta head to class. I'm gonna be late. Dang it. I'm sorry I'm late. I'm sorry I'm late. It won't happen again. I promise. I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm sorry, dude. I was getting picked up. You don't care? Oh. I'll make it up to you. And now the class has started, it's time for me to roam the hallways. Oh, yeah. Feels good to be the only kid in the hallway. I run this place. Feels good to be cool, popular, and even the teachers don't care. Watch this. I'll arrive to class as late as I want. Yeah, what's good? Nice work, teacher. Keep it up. Dude, this guy's really in my class? Yo. Hey, Melon, catch this. Ew! Did you just spit on me? Ow! That's disgusting! Teacher, teacher! You won't even look at me! What the heck's wrong with you? You're a bystander! Ew! <laughs> Don't like this. I gotta go to the bathroom. I gotta go to the bathroom. <sighs> That sunny guy is such a jerk. I'm just trying to live my life, but he keeps picking on me. I'm just gonna go in here and cry. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Bartholomew, do you mind if I go find that melon guy and bring him back to class? Yeah, you'd appreciate it? I know, he's slacking. He's trying to go to the bathroom and ignore all of the knowledge that you're sharing. Hey, melon! Melon! Uh, what's going on? Uh, what do you want, Sonny? You're such a nerd! Boom! And you're not even muscular? Look how skinny you are, bro. You're so mean. I'm out of here. What is wrong with you? That's right. Go home and cry, Melon. Ow. I don't even know how to get out of here. How do I get out of here? Cry to mommy. Cry to your mommy. You're such a baby. Stop. <laughs> You're so mean. That sunny guy is ruining my life. I just want to be myself and have fun. But he won't let me. He's making fun of me. He's calling me skinny he's punching me being so mean that's it tomorrow is the day i stand up for myself i won't let him walk all over me again oh, today's the day today's the day i stand up for myself it's off to school and i'm actually feeling good today i'm not even worried hey boys when this melon nerd gets to school let's pick on him again yeah let's destroy his watermelon friend right here and make him watch Hey, how's it going, Sonny? What's up? Yeah, Melon, really good, really good. You stand right there and watch as this happens right in front of your eyes. <laughs> no, I won't let you. Whoa, whoa, relax, Melon. That was actually really impressive. I thought you were just some stupid nerd. No, I'm a smart nerd with a mean uppercut. Damn. 
Dang. You know what? I think we could be friends. Wait, you think so? I actually really respect you, dude. You might be skinny and have a gigantic head, but you're pretty cool. Hey, let's go. What are we doing first, friend? Follow me. I've got an idea. Okay, Melon. I've got a great idea. Yeah, what's that, Sonny? Let's sneak out of class and prank everybody by putting something disgusting in their lockers. Like what? A piece of poop? That would be pretty good, but I don't have any poop lying around. But I do know that Professor Bartholomew, he's been making some nasty experiments in his desk. Look at this. Could you just distract him a little bit, actually? Yo, what's up, Bartholomew? Um, you got a nice bangs, bro. That's good. Keep it up, Melon. Tell him about his chalkboard and how smart he is. Bro, you're such a smart teacher. You should be teaching at university. You should not be teaching at a high school. You're a genius. Yes, Melon, I got it. I got the potatoes. Let's get out of here. Uh, bye. Okay, okay, follow me. Ooh, the principal's office. Principal Short Buzzums. What the heck? That's a weird name. Yeah, what the heck, dude? Um, what are we doing with these potatoes, though? Just follow me, Melon. We gotta be very sneaky. Yeah, sneaky be like they'll never suspect a thing just gotta break through into the cafeteria yo that's property damage you're crazy sonny throw a couple of these into the cafe and melon here's some for you yo i'm gonna go put it in everybody's lockers that's such a good idea it's gonna be stinky <laughs> i don't want to put that many in here give me these back i'll get locker six yo who has locker seven bro that thing is really reinforced what the heck is this 69 69 well i'm out of ideas well, it's okay we've completed our prank <laughs> just guide the evidence and let's go back to class good idea good idea and when the bell rings it's gonna be so stinky melon did you hear that class is up that was the bell yo let's go check on these lockers dude it's gonna be so smelly yo we can hear them they're already talking about it yo you guys smell that oh it's just Disgusting, right? Someone put rotten potatoes in everyone's locker? Ew, who would do that? <laughs> Melon, Melon, they're freaking out. Let's get out of here. That's so gross. That's so gross. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's dip, Sonny. We got to get out of here. It's too stinky. Oh, that was fun. But uh, I'm pretty tired, Sonny. I think I'm going to go hit, uh, hit the hay, get some sleep, and get ready for school tomorrow. Dude, it's the afternoon. It's not even that late. No wonder you're so tired, bro. You're too skinny, and all you do is sit on your butt and read books all day? Bruh, you've got to work out. You got to hit the weights. Let's go to the gym. I don't know, man. I got a lot of studying to do, and then I got to sleep, and then study some more, and then study and then study replace the studying with lifting and then you'll be as big and as strong as me all right let's do it welcome to the gym this is the place where boys become men yo sonny what the heck is this thing it's a pull-up bar check it out <sighs> 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 I'm getting strong. You're not even doing a full rep. This is how you do it. Wait, you know about pull-ups? <gasps> Yo, Melon, you're a natural. Yeah, bro, and then I bench here. Mm, which one do I think? Yeah, I'll just rep some of these out really quick. Melon, that's too heavy. I'll spot you. Get out of that. Get out of there. Ah, I'm getting crushed. Oh, oh, oh. That's why you always have a spotter. Yeah, <laughs> that was really dangerous. And you should always start with a warm-up. Couple of reps here. Yeah, that's a good little bit of bench pressing. And then one day you'll be as strong as me and you can hit the big weights. Oh, yeah. Oh, Sonny, you're actually strong, bro. But what's this machine? Oh, this is something for legs. But yeah, I skipped that. Yeah, let's just pretend this doesn't exist. Yo, Melon, you're looking buffer already. Yeah, bro. The gym paid off well. I feel so much better. And I'm freaking jacked. Whoa, keep those muscles to yourself, bro. I don't want to get beat up. Now follow me to class and let's pretend that we like to learn and then we'll sneak out later and do more pranks, right? What do you mean pretend? I love to learn, dude. I can't wait. Today's science. Ugh, not the periodic table. 
bro. Yeah, carbon and nitrogen? Oh, that's so interesting, bro. When you mix an acid and a metal, it creates salt water. Bro, what are you talking about? I'm out of here, dude. I'm gonna be in the bathroom if you wanna talk about some pranks. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah, yeah, uh-huh. Wait, Sonny, where'd you go? Sonny, where are you, bro? Oh, he's gonna do some pranks? <laughs> I'm kinda down for that. Yo, what's up, Sonny, bro? That lesson was super interesting. What's up? Oh, I thought I lost you to the books forever. Yeah, I have an idea. We should totally prank the principal. Yo, what are you thinking? Just check the toilet. It's in there. Yo, you have a poop bag? I'm not touching that, bro. That's all you. <laughs> come on, come on. You gotta touch the poop bag. Here, hold it, hold it. Oh, oh, it's so gross, dude. And now follow me. Principal Short Buzzums is gonna get trolled so hard. Just come inside here. Yo. Look, you just gotta put the poop bag next to that piston. Yo, you're actually evil, Sonny. Bro, this principal is gonna get dusted. And then I remove these trap doors. He won't be needing these decorations anymore. And then look. I got trip wires and string. I just gotta go like this and like that. And don't step on that melon, whatever you do. Why, what happens if I step on it? The poop drop! Oh, 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 bro, he's gonna get pooped on! Now that our prank is set up, I kinda wonder what else is in the principal's office. I've never been here before. Yo, you're right, bro. There's so many drawers, but why are they all empty? What's behind his desk? What does this say? Project Pig School? Whoa, what's in this drawer? Book and quill. Bro, do you hear that? The principal's on his way. We gotta get out of here now. Run, run. No, Melon. You got us pooped on. We gotta go. We gotta go. Gross, bro. Disgusting. Okay, I just escaped. The principal almost got back to his office. He would have caught us poop handed. Now, what's in this book? Project Pig School. Principal Short Bottoms in collaboration with... I'm having a hard time reading this. I'm gonna need Melon's help. He's got a bigger brain than me. Yo, what's up, guys? How's it going, right? Those potatoes. Yeah. Okay, guys, I lost the principal. I gotta reunite with Sonny. Melon, I need help. I need some help, Melon. What's up, Sonny? What's up? Come out here and read this for me. I don't know what it was saying. Project Pig School. Principal Short Buzzums in collaboration with Melon Institute will be conducting an experiment. The experiment will be taking place in the school and will involve student mutation. What? The experiment will be testing Megalodon Industries' new product, Mutatron, by turning every student from this school into a pig, patented by Dr. Longbottoms. Bro, what? This experiment will be taking place at the last day of school. Caution, when you turn on the machine, evacuate the area immediately. Mind wave particles travel through blocks. What? Lab 72423. Sonny, this is bigger than us. This is huge, bro. The whole school's in jeopardy. This isn't good. Dr. Longbottoms is back. And anytime he's involved, things go horribly, horribly wrong. Yeah, bro. I remember. He's the one that killed my parents. And he turned us into babies. Dang that, dude. Sonny and Melon, to the principal's office. Now. Uh, Melon? <laughs> Did you hear that on the loudspeaker? This isn't good. The principal's called us to his office. Bro, uh, I'm scared, Sonny. I hope he doesn't notice the book. I hope it's not about the poop either. I just hope he doesn't turn us into pigs because he's in on it with Dr. Longbottom. Yes, principal? I don't know why there's poop remnants. That's weird. Sonny, thank God. It's just about the poop. You're right. This could have been so much worse. Yeah, we're so horribly sorry. It'll never happen again. What? We're expelled? Dang it! Fine, we'll leave the premises immediately. Melon, we've got to get out of here and find a way to stop Dr. Longbottoms and the principal from turning all of our classmates into pigs. But what do we do, Sonny? I don't know. You're the one with the big brain. All right, let me calculate something. Sonny, I've got it. I remember when I was researching mind wave particles, there's one materials that can stop them. What's that? It's netherite, bro. Put on these netherite boots. The mind wave particles will come from the floor. So as long as you stop the entry point, you'll be okay. Are you serious? Netherite's a material strong enough to prevent mind wave technology particles? Yeah, bro. Follow me. We've got to save the school. This is so cool, Melon. I never thought being a nerd could be this awesome. 
move. Uh, yeah, it's pretty freaking radical, bro. <laughs> yeah, sure is. Gnarly, gnarly, bro. Sonny, we gotta start sneaking. We're gonna get on school property soon, and we're expelled. The security guards won't be happy to see us. Melon, it's the last day of school. We've gotta hurry if we're gonna save everyone. Sonny, the school's been locked down. Look at all the windows, bro. They're sealed up with iron blocks. Dude, this isn't good. The principal and Dr. Longbottoms, they've already started the experiment. Dude, we've gotta save everyone inside. We gotta hurry now. But Melon, how the heck are we gonna get inside? It's so fortified. I remember that acid dissolves metal if we collect 432 redstone and mix it with 17 sulfuric water pieces we can create sulfuric acid which we can then use to dissolve two blocks to fit exactly our player models in but maybe we'd have to lose a little bit of weight so we'd have to go on a diet during all of this and then no 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 i just remembered there's a better way to get inside of the school follow me melon what what do you mean back when i was the school bully i remember i flushed some little kid down a toilet and i think he shot out right at the back of the school school around here somewhere yeah this looks like the place there's got to be a sewer system attached to this water um i don't see wait bro you're right i just found something it's right here yeah so if we just swim through this we should be able to find our way back into the school Yo, this is so sick. It's a little gross, actually, but it's worth it. We're gonna become heroes. Bro, I think I'm literally in a toilet right now. Dude, we're in the plumbing. We are in the school plumbing. Oh, Sonny, I'm drowning. I just came out of a toilet. That's so weird. Bro, that was trippy. But now we gotta be very stealthy, Sonny. We don't want the principal to find us. If anyone knows we're here, Melon, if anyone finds out we're in the school, they're gonna turn everyone into pigs before we have a chance to stop them where is their machine oh i heard the principal bro i just heard him make a noise the most evil sound of them all melon i found a clue it's complicated numbers there's an algorithm it's gotta mean something no bro that's just when i solved pi last week give me the book though sonny i remember there's a code on it okay i'll let you do the big brain reading lab seven two four two three bro it's the password to the locked locker downstairs you're right it was the one we we couldn't put any potatoes inside of. That's gotta be the code to get in. We've just gotta sneak down to this locker and stop their plans. Sonny, it started! No! One of our classmates, she's been turned into a pig! We gotta hurry up, Sonny. We've gotta hurry up! Move it, move it, move it! Put in the code, Melon! Melon? Don't tell me you forgot the code. Uh, no, don't worry. I remembered it. I was just double checking. Two, four, two, three. Yes, we've made it in, Sonny. Follow me. What is this? Where does this lead to? Dude, it's Dr. Longbottom's secret lab. We just gotta do a little bit of parkour to make it over. Yes. Make the jumps. Make the jumps. Yo, what is this? What do you think this machine does? Bro, it's the pig reactor, dude. Normally, the microwaves would have turned us into pigs by now. But because of our netherite boots, we're okay. You're right, bro. These boots are awesome. Now, we've got to figure out a way to stop this machine. We've got to find a way to shut off the reactor. Well, Melon, there's this really weird piston thing. What does this do? Bro, this is a piston to push this block to deactivate it. We just need to find a hand crank somewhere. Okay, Melon, let's look around the room really fast. Barrels, can't open these. Um, the pig. Hello, pig. Uh, do you know where a hand crank is? Bro, there's a brown valve handle. Yes, we can use this to deactivate the beacon. Dude, I can't turn it. Melon, we're gonna need to use both of our hands at the same time. Ready? Grab hold of the valve and crank it in three, two, one, go! Yes! Bro, we did it! We turned off the reactor. Self-destruct sequence initiated. T-minus 60 seconds. Meltdown. 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 Melon, did you hear that? We've got to get out of here. We got to get out now. And we've got to tell everyone to leave the school. We got to go. We got to go. We've got to tell everyone to get out of here. Quick, Melon. You go upstairs. I'll get the cafeteria. Everybody evacuate. Evacuate. Steve and cafeteria lady Steve. 
Let's get out of here. It's gonna blow. Run. Even you, Mr. Principal, you gotta get out of here. If anyone's in the gymnasium, you gotta leave now. Okay, Mel, I think we warned everyone. We have 30 seconds. Go, go, go. We gotta get to a safe distance. Come on, Melon. You've gotta move. Oh, wait, that's not you. That's your brother. Yeah, bro, it's okay. He's gonna be chilling. Melon, we did it. We got everyone to evacuate just in time. Self-destruct in three, two, one. Yo! Melon, the school, it's gone. Bro, all that matters is that everyone's safe and we saved the day. And your cousin, he's alive. Let's go. Maromini, no! What is wrong with you? What, bro? I just thought you'd want to remove your cousin from the blast zone. Dude, the blast zone already happened and now you killed him. Good job. We did it. We saved the school. And you guys can save that subscribe button. Today in Minecraft, we went from being peasants to kings. Oh, man. Working on this farm is so hard. Mm, yes, this is much better. Mm, yes. And if you want to become a king, too, then you simply have to subscribe to our channel. Mm, yes, quite. Sonny, Sonny, the kingdom's under attack. What are we gonna do? Bro, we're just peasants. There's nothing we can do. I'm gonna go take a look, though. And if the king needs backup, we'll have to put our lives on the line. Sonny, are you sure it's dangerous up there? Be careful. I'm gonna go take a look and make sure we're winning the battle. <laughs> Melon, our king's dead. The other army prevailed. This isn't good. No, what is that? What is that? Sonny, get up, bro. Get up. You're still alive. Oh, my head hurts. What happened? Sonny, you got hit by the catapult. It went straight into your face, but it just barely missed and knocking you out. I don't know, bro. It sure feels like it hit me. What happened? Is the king alive? Did we win? No, Sonny, we didn't. The enemies killed our entire army along with our king. This isn't good, bro. We're gonna have to gear up and try and defend the city ourselves. Sonny, there's no time. We gotta hurry up if we wanna do that. They're storming the gates as we speak. Okay, let's get to the armory. We've gotta get some gear. Yo, Sonny, they left two kits left. It's perfect. Come on, give me the armor. Whoa. This this looks so cool. Melon, you look powerful. Yes, I do. Sonny, I'll take the bow. You take the sword. It's time we get our revenge. Check it out. I've got a great sword. I look so goaded. Okay, it's time to protect the kingdom. We can do this, Melon. Follow me. They're storming the gates. To the front lines. Don't worry, Mr. Villager. We'll keep you safe. Yo, our villagers are really strong, Melon. Maybe they can back us up. Look at this. Oh, sorry, sorry. why are you hurting our villagers? Stop that. Melon, I hear the evil knights outside. Let's take them down. Yo, they're coming at me, Sonny. Yo, get in there. I got your back. Yo, they're crazy. There's so many, Sonny. There's so many. Okay, I have the great sword. I'll eliminate them. Yes, we've done it. Wait, Sonny, there's more out there. We got to take them out. We can do it. You start shooting at them from a distance. I'll sneak in once you've weakened them. I'm like Legolas. Get dead. Get dead. Yes, keep going, Melon. Keep shooting them. Hold them back. Ow. These guys are nuts. One more. Finish it. Oh, there's one other one right there, Sonny. Yeah, that's what I meant. I'm gonna let you get this kill. Hey. We did it, bro. I think we saved the city. It's just kind of sad that all of our soldiers and our king, they're dead. Sonny, they all passed away. But don't worry. We saved the kingdom. Wait, Sonny. What is that? What is that? Retreat to the tower. Melon, I can hear the dragon. It's so Close. Reloading! Come on, die! Yo, he dodged you! Yo, reload it! Reload it! I'm trying! Where is he? He's right above you! Hurry up, Sonny! I'm trying! Let him attack! I can take the hit! And die! Oh, that was inaccurate. Sonny, reloading! 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 Sonny, hurry up! Shoot him! Die! Yes! 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 <laughs> that was way too close, Melon. But I think we saved the kingdom! We did it! We saved the kingdom! But, um, Sonny, the king's dead. Uh, who's gonna be in charge now? You're right. I guess it's up to the people to decide. Melon, the people, we've saved them. Wait, you think we should be your kings? It would be an honor and a privilege to serve you. It will be my great duty. Sonny, we must rebuild this great kingdom 
to its former glory. Actually, Sonny, I don't want to be a king. It sounds like way too much responsibility. You're right. There's a lot of work that comes with it, Melon. A lot of responsibilities. So I'll handle this. Yeah, King Sonny. And Melon, you could be my right-hand man, the top knight in the kingdom. I'm fine with that. Ah, yes, the king's chambers. Let me grab my crown and my beautiful tunic. Sonny, this is actually really cool. This chamber is awesome. I think I want to crash here. Nope, this is the royal king's chambers. Not for a simple lowly noble like you, Melon. You're nothing but a knight. I am the king. You must show respect. Okay, fine. Ow! You shoot me again. I'm gonna have to execute you. Calm down, calm down, calm down, Sonny. I was just saying, I like your chambers. They're really cool. But what's up here, bro? Whoa, the king's old attic. This is weird. Why wasn't he keeping this place clean and tidy? I don't know, but... Yo, there's a book. There is a mountain. Wait, what? This book is called There is a Mountain. What the heck, Melon? What do you think it's about? I don't know, Sonny. I'm gonna find out. I've heard of a mountain. A frost mountain containing the evil of the overworld. Ancient texts tell me that defeating this evil grants absolute power. Power that must be destroyed for the greater good. Yes, power. I could go for some more power. I mean... Yeah, Melon, that is a great idea. We should definitely go and track down this power source and destroy all evil from the world. That must be what's causing all these wars. I've heard tales that in other kingdoms, there have been great wars as well. Hey, Carl, who said you could come up here to the king's attic? Banished forever. Yo, Carl was a good man. He had a family and kids. And now he's been banished to the afterlife. That was his fault. He should have never stepped in my attic. I keep important information up here, Melon, like the secret of the mountain. Okay, Sonny, you're being real. Really, really weird, all right? We gotta stop this mountain, all right? For the people! For the people! Not for me. Not for me. Lord Melon, first knight of this lands, I order you to seek out the evil mountains, gather reconnaissance, and bring it back. I will do this for you, Lord Sonny. I'm out of here! Hey, it's King Sonny! Oh, King Sonny and the people. But most importantly, the people. Yes, kiss my feet. Hey, get back here and kiss my feet. I don't know what you said. I'm out of here! Here. As the king of this land, I've got a lot of responsibilities to uphold while Melon seeks out the evil mountain. First things first, villagers, get to work! We've got crops to harvest, walls to rebuild, do it quicker! And I guess I'll participate just a wee little bit, because, you know, a king's got to get his hands dirty sometimes. And, yeah, that'll do. Couple of carrots. I've done my part, I would say. And I suppose I could do a little rebuilding of the walls here. Yeah, just install a couple of stairs, place a few more blocks to fortify the kingdom once again, and that looks pretty good. Peasants! Why aren't you working? Do something productive! What, you think I'm gonna be the king of this land for nothing? Pay your taxes! Cough it up, little kid! Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? Bring me your taxes! Guys, I hope the power is not getting to Sunny. Um, wait, there's smoke over there! I really gotta be careful. It could be an enemy outpost, please. Wait, they're friendly! The world hasn't gotten to them yet! Yo! Yes! Hello, good night! Hello, good sir! I need to explain to you something. The reason this world is so at war and corrupt there's an ancient weapon in this evil mountain that we need to destroy. But I can't destroy it alone. I need backup. Are you men willing to help me? You will? Thank you! Wait, what's that sound? Yo! They're coming to attack us! Men! Men! To war! Hiya! Hiya! Oh no! Oh no! I'm low! I need backup! I need backup! Please help me! Defeat them! Die! Lord Knight of Evil, you shall not survive! Please die! Yes! We did it! We won! Now bring me the prisoner. Yo, look at you, buddy. Look at you. You thought you could just attack us like that? Completely unprovoked? Now tell us where your base is located. And if you know anything about this great old mountain. I don't know anything about the mountain. Please, don't hurt me. Okay, I'll spare you for the greater good. But you're gonna stay in here for a little while. Now, we must raid this base. For the people! Follow me, man! Hey, great work, villagers. I'm so proud of you. Looks like you've constructed a new flour mill so we can harvest our wheat and have greater food production for the people. But no, 
But what about my army? I need a stronger military if I'm going to command these lands. I must be a powerful leader. I won't just be a peaceful ruler making bread. I need an army. Ah, great work, villagers, so far in the military encampment. But where do you think you're going? Just because it's raining and it's nighttime? You think you could sleep on the job? I'm going to make an example of you so that they all know what will happen. Die! Now get back to work. Yes, I've brought in the expert craftsmen. Now finish the armory. Make this the most powerful military in all of Minecraft. We finally found the enemy encampment and my boys are here. The battering ram's ready for me? All right, time to bust down this door. Breakthrough. Knights, storm the castle. Storm the castle. Hold on, I gotta break this fence. Hold on, it's really hard to use. Whoa, there we go. Charge. Get in. And one final one. Yes. Oh, the battle is won at last. Oh, and even the weather is cleared. Oh, that's beautiful. Now, what is in this tower? What secrets are the enemies hiding? Yo, there's tons of ammunition. Yo, there's tons of pork chops too. And wait, why is there nothing in this chest, huh? Wait a second. Pixels look different here. Hold on. Yo, I found a barrel. What are they hiding? A compass and a book. Hold on. What does this book say? I looked north and there I saw it. The cold north. A mountain of snow as if an angel fell and raised the earth around it. Covering it with snow. In the middle, a demon lies. Protecting its evil. Yo, this compass. It must lead to the mountain. I need to tell King Sonny. I'm on my way, Sonny. King Sonny. King Sonny. Work faster, you peasants. What am I paying you for? What is going on? What do you mean I'm paying you nothing? I'm letting you live in my kingdom. Now build my military. S Sonny, what's going on? Oh, hey there, Lord Melon, the knight of the realm. How are you doing, bruh? I'm doing good, but why are our villagers trapped in a cage? Oh, don't worry about this. These are just, uh, they're just working on a big project and they wanted it to be a surprise for you when you got back, seeing how you're the commander of the military and all. But uh, just give me a second. Uh, it's not done yet. Get back to work! Okay, Melon. So uh, what news do you bring? Yo, Sonny, don't hit them. Don't hit them, Sonny. They are people and they must be treated with respect. But anyways, I have more important matters. Sonny, I've located the mountain, which contains the ultimate power. We must be destroyed. Yes! Finally, Melon! How do we get there? Let's make haste at once! Wait, where'd my horse go? Oh, it's right over here. Follow me, Sonny! Let me go get the royal steed. Okay, goats. While I go to grab the royal horse, I just want to say something. Melon wants to destroy this power, but why destroy something when you can harness it and have every neighboring kingdom bow down to our strength, our wealth, and power? So yeah, let's go find this evil man mountain and see what we can do about it. The royal steed is here, Melon. What is that, Sonny? You like it? It's called a hippogriff. It's a flying horse. I found it in the king's bunker. Dude, that is insane. With that power, we'll be able to conquer this mountain easily. Follow me, Sonny. I'm right behind you. Or dare I say it, above you. Yo, you're insane. I know. I'm pretty cool. I know. Dude, this place this is so weird. What the heck is that? And why are there bears guarding the entrance? Sonny, I located the secret entrance. I need backup. Melon, I'm almost there. I see the ice spikes. This place is crazy. Backup's here. Take out the polar bears. Help me. I'm attacking. I'm using my hippogriff to defeat them. Ow, ow, ow. Die, die, get out of here. I got this. I don't want my boy to die. I'm gonna leave him right here. Stay safe, buddy. Okay, Sonny, let's just run in. Let's just run in. What the heck is that? I think this is an evil monster that tried to take the power of the mountain for itself and it got turned into a statue. I think you're right, Sonny. The power, it corrupts absolutely. We must destroy it. Watch out for these ice spikes. Yeah, I'll be right behind you. Guys, I won't let the power corrupt me. I'll wield it, and I'll control all of Minecraft. Okay, Melon, yeah, I'm right here, bro. I'm right here. Where are we going? To the center of it all. Dude, do you see that? It's a giant frost maw. That must be the source of the power. That beast is enormous. 
He must be protecting it. He must be. I will shoot him from afar, Sonny. You get in close and deal the big damage. Uh, Melon, better idea. Why don't we just let him sleep and go take the item? It's too late. Oh, God. I woke him up. Dang it, Melon. He was sleeping for thousands of years. You could have just left him. Ow. I'm frozen, Sonny. Help. I got your back. I'm sneaking in. Die. Die, Frostma. Ow. Ow. He's doing so much damage. I've got him. I've got him. Sonny, I'm at two hearts. I'm at two hearts. Keep him distracted while I smack him in the butt. Oh, no. He's turning on me. He's turning on me. Ow. One heart. One heart. Woo. One heart. Melon, back at my hippogriff. There's a bunch of golden apples. I forgot to take them out. It's okay. It's okay. I can survive this. Ow. Half a heart, Sonny. Take him. <laughs> I'll finish the battle. Yes! I killed the Frost Maw. And now the reward, the power, it'll be all mine. Yes. Claim myself the soul of the Frost Maw. Now I command the ice crystal. All that's left is to grab the ultimate weapon. Give it to me! Yes. This must be it. The weapon of the gods. Yes. The staff of the gods is now mine. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> yes, the power. I can feel it flowing through me. Emperors, kings, lords of all types will bow down to me. I will control Minecraft and instill a permanent peace that will last all of eternity. Yes, yes. Guys, what is Sonny doing? Hey, Sonny, what's going on? I heard you rambling some crazy stuff. I don't know what you mean, crazy stuff, Melon. I'm gonna reign and have a permanent peace over all of Minecraft. All I have to do now is power this staff of the gods up with the fires of the doomed. Yes, I will stoke these flames and it will breathe an eternal life over these lands like the phoenix rising from the ashes, Melon. I will be the king of both ice and fire! Sonny, are you telling me you want all this power for yourself? Why would I destroy the staff of the gods, Melon, <laughs> when I could become one? All I need to do now is infuse the staff of the gods with the fires of doom, and then I'll be in control of both ice and fire. Nothing will be able to stop me. I will be in charge of all of Minecraft and put a permanent peace that no one will ever stop. Yes, yes. <laughs> Guys, I think Sonny's losing his mind. I have to stop him. I have to. I'm sorry, Sonny. I'm sorry. Yes. Wait, Melon, Melon. Why? Why? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Sonny. Absolute power corrupts absolutely. And even you couldn't handle it. But I had to bring peace to all of Minecraft. I had to do it. Do you guys know what's even more powerful than the staff of the gods? Pressing that like and subscribe button. Today in Minecraft, we grew up and became super top secret spies. Shh. Don't blow my cover, guys. Press the like button right now to blow Melon's cover. <laughs> Ah, help! The guards are chasing me! Quickly, goats, subscribe right now to save me! Wait, Melon, we're babies! <laughs> What's happening? Where'd mom and dad go? And why is your head so huge? What do you mean? Why is your head so huge? Dude, your head is clearly way bigger than mine. No, no, no. Your head is bigger than mine. Comment down below whose head is bigger. It's clearly yours, bro. Your melon is gigantic right now. It might actually be a little bit bigger. <laughs> it's just because I'm smarter, Sonny. Bro, you have four melon seeds for a brain. There's not a lot going inside of that noggin. Yeah, and how much melon seeds do you have, huh? How many do you have? Zero. I've got a big galaxy brain, and you've got four seeds. Dude, there's nothing happening in your head. Now, I'm taking this book. It's a letter from mom and dad. Let's read. Hey, kids, your mom and I are on a secret spy mission, so we won't be able to supervise your training. You two will become the best spies ever. Love, mom and dad. P.S. This is just a simulation, but it will still hurt a lot. So try not to die too much. What the heck is wrong with our parents? Dude, they're trying to train us to become the greatest spies of all time. I don't blame them. Sonny, let's do our first trial. Okay, open it up, Melon. Oh. Melon, there's laser beams everywhere. Don't let them touch you. Be very careful, Sonny. Follow my lead. Ow! 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 <laughs> yeah, don't let
let him touch you. Oh, oh, gotta dodge it. Oh, oh, gotta, I, I can't touch that one. No way. Ow, ow, ow. That was not my best trial ever, Melon. I won't lie. Sonny, now follow my lead here. Ow, stop doing that. I didn't touch you even once there. Yeah, you did. Let me show you how it's done, bro. It's like, boom. Oh, wait, why am I getting vaporized? Ow, ow. Okay, I'm fine. Sonny, this isn't a lesson in dodging lasers. This is a lesson in taking a hit. Let's go. Half a heart. Oh, that was so close. Are you sure you're on half a heart? What if I were to... Eh, 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 eh. <sighs> Hey, Melon, it looks like we unlocked grapple hooks. Yeah, can I have one, please, Sonny? Oh, you don't want me to dual wield them? No, just give me one. A Kimbo grapple hook. Oh, my God. Just give me a grapple hook, please. There you go, you little baby. How do I do this? Just don't shoot them in my forehead. Shoot them way up high. How do I do this, Sonny? Oh, there we go. This looks pretty tricky, bro. Uh, You want to go first? Yeah, I'll show you how it's done, Sonny. It's quite simple. All you do is go. Go what you go what dude it's not working move aside move aside ah ah <laughs> now what now what bro no yo he's on fire it's okay i live i survived these yes i've done it wait why am i still burning one heart Woo, that was close go dude i made it i'm alive hey light work my dude yeah and then i gotta pull myself up and i did it without even touching the lava okay melon we've passed another test up next, it looks like we have silenced weapons. This is how spies carry about their missions. We've got to be really careful here. Oh, I think we got to shoot out the glass. I'll go first. Melon, why'd you push me? <laughs> Sonny, how did you miss that badly? Oh, my. Sonny, this is how it's done. Nice one. Yeah, really nice. Uh, well, Sonny, we're out of ammo. Bro, we're not out of bullets. Just press the reload button. Everything's going to be fine. Check it out. Okay. And you hit this glass. Let me handle this one. Let me handle this one. Right there. I got it. I got it. We're actually crazy. One more glass. One more to go. I got this. Busted it. Yo, there's only one glass pane left. Hey, I got it. Yo, and the door opened up. That was good shooting, Melon. Thank you. Ow! Oh, sorry. Sorry. You got to be careful when you're handling a firearm. It's okay, Melon. This is just a simulation. We're fine. You. Bro, we've just got to get down this hallway and see what the next challenge we're gonna be super secret spies in no time dude you're right what is this uh melon there's a guard over here uh oh no 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 i didn't mean to bring him over sonny run, run why okay melon this time we need to be a little more careful not to have this guard come over to us all right sonny we've got to avoid him and we can't use lethal force check this out grapple hook up here that's pretty smart okay he's very strong and we're gonna grapple hook oh no What'd you do, Melon? Why can't I go? What is happening? Yo, I gotta go. I gotta go. What are you doing? I figured out the way to do this. I'm scared, Sonny. I don't want to move. I don't want to move. All you have to do is open up a trap door, bro. Go inside of it. And then I gotta go all the way through this ventilation like a secret spy would do. And once I get to the other end, it's easy pickings. He got to me, Sonny. He won't get to me, though, Melon. Keep him distracted for me, all right? I just gotta press this button. Oh, uh, Melon, I'm out of the Event. Do you see me over here? Yo, you made it, Sonny. I got him distracted. Grab the key card and get out of here. Well, I got the key card, but I'm not so sure I can get out of here in one piece. Uh, I'll distract him, Sonny. I'll go on a run. I'll go on a run. No, Melon, you brought him over to me. I'm sorry, Sonny. Uh, Melon, can you get him on another run, actually? I'm floating above his head right now. Yep, I got you, Sonny. I got you. That would be very, very convenient. Uh, he doesn't even see me right now, Sonny. Hold on, hold on. Wait, Melon, better idea. I'll give you the key card get out of here hey see you melon what is your deal uh would you look at that sonny i got the key card yo melon why did you die for that sonny we gotta go now we gotta go now trust me okay okay we made it through close the door everything's fine yo we got airplane yo hopping in the melon mobile yo stop stop we got a letter for mom and dad we gotta read oh oh sorry hey kids congrats on completing the train Training. 
We knew you would make it. Make your way to this coordinate here for your first mission. Love, mom, and dad. That's all they said. We're already having our first mission? Dude, we're like two years old. I know. Get in the planes. I'm out of here. See you, nerd. Dude, I can't even see. My head is too small. I'm taking off. Oh, no. Oh, no. Melon, follow me to our first mission. Where is that? This way. No! I crashed. Unlucky. Yo, Melon, we grew up a little bit. We're like big kids now. Dude, this bunker is awesome. It's like that bunker from Spy Kids. You're right. And we just made it to our first mission. But hey, Melon, I got a really good idea. What's that? Being where kids and all. I dare you to play hide and seek with me. Uh, no. Well, I'm hiding first. You seek. Okay, okay, okay. Chill, chill. You got two minutes, Sonny. Sounds good, bro. Two minutes is lots of time. Let's see. There's got to be some really cool spots around here somewhere. Maybe some secret spy bookshelf? No, nothing there. What about this room? There's gotta be- Ooh, the staircase. Maybe there's some ghost blocks. Wait, this looks a bit sus. This is not normal. Yo, secret spy torch! Dude, this is amazing! I just found the secret spy area! Wait a second. It looks like I found our first mission. We have a map explaining what we've gotta do to complete this heist? Yo, what the heck? This is so cool! We've got gear, a top secret computer to hack stuff. Oh, Melon's gonna be pretty impressed. But first, let me hide. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, I don't think he'll be checking this bathtub anytime soon. All right, Melon, I'm ready. Okie dokie, Sonny, where are you? Sonny, wait, what is this? Bro, this is a secret spy room. Sonny, I'm not playing hide and seek, bro. We gotta get to work. Yo, you found the mission room as well? Yeah, dude, you left the door open. Oh, <laughs> my bad. I was gonna show that to you after hide and seek. But yeah, this is our mission. It looks really cool, huh? Where do we start? Sonny will come from the ocean or melon car or climb from the roof or make diversion. No, dude, obviously we each have our own missions. Look, I come from the ocean and I get on top of the roof to prepare for the infiltration. And you have to do your steps in order to help make this all work out for me. Let me read this book too. Your first mission. There is a powerful evil group gathering in a mansion. They have four stolen cores of an atomic bomb. The cores must be retrieved. Or what? There was no or anything. So, Melon, if we don't retrieve these cores, uh, it's a mystery. Who knows what'll happen? Bro, everything will become nothing. It's a metaphor, Sonny. You're right. So that means study your to-dos and grab your gear. Oh, oh, I, sh I shot my gear. Sonny, first, I want to... Took all my gear. Thanks. Here. Here's your suit up. That's the most important part. It's time for us to become spies. Let's go. Let's do this. It worked. We're in our super cool spy outfits now. Yo, I am looking classy. Finsbury is going to the ball. Yo, you're right. Good job, Melon. Get in character and get ready to make a diversion. Fancy your talk to this. You can understand me. No, that's some fancy. You're just mumbling now. Those aren't words. Mm -hmm. Where's your monocle, Mr. Melon? My monocle is on, and I have a very big underbar. Okay, let's just get out of here and secure the mission. Melon, before we go on this mission, we need to test our communication pieces. Make sure you've got one in your ear. I got mine in my suit tie, and I'm gonna go way far over here. All right, all right. I got one in my ear. Don't you even worry. Okay, shh. Melon, come in. Melon, come in. Ch -ch -ch. Yep, Melon here. Over. All right, roger that, Melon. Ch over and out. Over and out. Yep, this thing works. Over. Ch Mr. Finsbury, are you there? Mm, yes, Finsbury's on your line. Over. Yes, excellent, Mr. Finsbury, Melon. We are ready to complete the mission. Mm, let's meet me in my car. Mm, all right, Sonny, hop in my car. Let, let me in. Let me in. Please, let me in. I will get in the passenger seat. Get in the driver's seat. You're the one driving us out of here. You're going to the ball. Relax, I am Finsbury. And once we arrive, you will let me out early. Mama, don't skid! Don't skid! I'm sorry. We shall be there in no time. Don't you worry. This isn't a rocket ship. It shouldn't be pointing up like this. Hey, don't worry. In three, two, one, blast off! Okay, Mr. Finsbury Mellon, let me out of here. I gotta go do my spy stuff now. Ow! Thanks. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. I'm gonna go pull up as Mr. Finsbury to the ball. Oh, no. What is happening? Ah! What is happening? I can do this. I can do this. 
No. Chill, chill, you're some very classy. Hello there, sirs. Hello there. How is it going? It's Sir Finsbury. Does that mean a thing to you? Well, it should, because I own five of the great seven estates of Minecraft. Yeah, now let me in. Mm, beautiful parking. Okay, guys, I'm going around the mansion. I need to find a way up to the rooftop. There's gotta be something around here somewhere. W wait a second, what is this? Yo, I just found an emergency escape. Shh, Melon, come in. Melon, come in. Shh, shh. Coming in, coming in. I found a secret emergency exit for us. Once we complete this heist and the mission is clear, we're gonna get this boat and scoot right out of this place. The evil villains will never suspect a thing. Yes, I mean, yes, indeed, that sounds great. That sounds splendiferous. I think I just need to grapple hook up here. Pull myself up. I thought that was a guard. It's just a cow. Oh, that scared me. But let me make sure I take a good view of the landscape before I try and sneak my way inside. Yo, there are guards. I knew it. There's one guard here and a second one. Hope he didn't see me. I hope he didn't see me. I'm gonna have to take them out silently. One down. Look at this guy. He didn't even notice. Both guards eliminated. It's time for me to roll in. <laughs> Okay, the coast looks clear. There's nobody here. I've got to use my grapple hook and get on top of this roof somehow. Mm, well, hello, good sir. I'm looking for some food. Oh, this looks beautiful. Bountiful amounts of cake. Oh, is this strawberry? Is this ice cream? Mm, what do you think about the food here, sir? Uh, Finsbury, you, you left your microphone on. I really don't need to hear about the cakes like that. Mm, this cake is delicious. Oh, if only I could share this with my friend, but he's doing doing something else. Yes, I'm trying to scale the mansion right now. This isn't easy. <sighs> Okay, guys, I just got to get a little higher up and I should be on top of the roof. Come on. Yes, that was awesome. Shh, Melon, come in. Melon, come in. I'm on the rooftop. Mm, yes, give me a second. Okay, I can stop being posh. Uh, what's up, Sonny? What's up? I made it to the rooftop. Can you locate the atomic core room? I'll find a way to drop in and steal it. Okay, I'll look around, Sonny, but I think I'm drawing a lot of attention to myself right now. I'm a little scared. I actually, Melon, I found it on my own. Don't worry about it. You, you do you. Stay safe out there. Okay, I'm going to keep eating cake. Mmm, yes, this cake is delicious. I'm breaking in. I can see the security system. They've got a cross pattern of laser beams. This is gonna be pretty tricky. Melon, there's guards everywhere in this room. I need you to create a diversion. Yeah? Melon, their backs are turned. I'm going down. I can't get through the security system. I'm gonna need you to turn off the power. Please don't look up. Please don't look up. Please don't look up. I think I'm fine, Melon. They're not gonna see me. I'm on the ceiling. But I need you to disable the laser system. Okay, Sonny. I see the power room, but I need to create a distraction. I brought some TNT and flint and steel. I'm gonna create an explosion and then use my code breaker, access the power room, and disable those lasers. Do 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 I'm not doing anything under these stairs. Ooh, no one's looking at me. And walk away like nothing happened. Mm, yes, this cake is enjoyed and beautiful. Dude, I just exploded it! They're all running towards it! This is my chance. This is my chance. Access the power room. Shh! Melon Finsbury! I need you to turn off these lasers already! Hurry up! Dude, the Code breaking failed. Hold on. One more try. No, it failed again. Come on. Please work. Please work. Yes, it worked on the last try. Time to disable the power. First floor. Second floor. Basement floor. That's perfect. I'm going to grapple down. They won't see me. Ow. Why did the cores just bounce me? Ow. What is with this? It's like a trampoline. Melon, I'm trying to grab the cores. Yes, I got him. I'm going up. I'm getting out of here. Sonny, I need help. I'm stuck in the power room. Oh, well, I'm stuck in the security room. They didn't see me. These guards are so dumb. Melon, where are are you? I'm underneath the stairs like Harry Potter. I'm coming down. I don't even care. No witnesses. Yes, they're all gone. Melon, I'm coming downstairs now. Help me, Sonny. Don't worry, Mr. Finsbury Potter. I'll save you in no time. Codebreaker, codebreaker. Get out. <gasps> Okay, we gotta dip. Sonny, where's the escape route? I've got a plan. Don't worry. I'm gonna go back upstairs and get to the escape boat. I don't want to startle any of the guests. Just get back into character. Mr. Finsbury, you're fine. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah. 
Yes, how is it going? How is it going? Did you see that explosion? That was weird, right? What do you mean you saw me go behind the stairs right before it exploded? How dare you accuse me? Do you even know who I am? I will have you killed! Shh, Melon, Melon, I found the way out. I found the way out. I'm on the rooftops. I'm gonna drop down to the boat. Find your way to the basement, quick! Uh, I will get back to you. I will get back to you. Sunny, they're on me. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here! Where's the basement? Just find your way down to the cellars. There's gotta be an escape route. I'll meet you at the boat. Melon, I'm at the boat! I'm at the boat! Oh, yes, uh, says, yes, I wish you would do, and, uh, have a great one, and- I'm out of here! I'm out of here! I'm out of here! Sunny, where's the docks? <laughs> I gotta dip! Sunny, do you know the passcode to this door? There's a passcode to the door. Oh, uh, do you have any more code breaker left? Yeah, I got you. I got you. And open. And open. Oh, uh, you're out of luck. Sorry, Melon. Don't leave me! Melon, quit being a baby. Just go to the water. Okay, okay, meet me there. Please, they're on to me, Sonny. Melon, are you up by the water yet? Yeah, I'm waiting for you on shore. All right, I'm gonna show up in a really epic ride. Not this one, guys, but this one. The best boat in Minecraft. The classic boat. Melon, Melon, where are you? I'm ready right here bro go out where are you man i don't know we're here oh there you are come on get in yo yo drive by drive by yeah totally this is the most epic escape boat oh sunny i missed i missed i missed i missed i missed yeah, let's get out of here i'm rowing as fast as i can row let's go we saved the day bro we've got the atomic bomb cores and i think we successfully completed our first spy mission yo mom and dad are gonna be so proud of us yo sunny you see that island it looks pretty cool yo you're right let me check it out let me check it out oh this is awesome sunny give me the cores right now wait what why give me the cores i don't want to shoot you but i will if you don't hand them over here just take them bro just take them i'm gonna get paid a lot of money for this i'll be able to afford two glistening melons <laughs> what are you doing bro we're supposed to become spies and save minecraft uh yeah so another spy organization reached out and offered me two million diamonds for these four cores sonny are you sure they're not super villains uh, they might be but you know i don't really care at the end of the day there's just one last thing i gotta do tie up some loose ends no, no, no. Melon, Melon, we can talk about this. Please, guys, like the video quick before Melon shoots me. And click the next video on screen.